Your order from Barnes Bookshop has arrived, Doctor. Barnes insists on delivering the books to our door, even though we could ease... Local gossip. That's good service. Uninteresting. Another letter from Werner. I never reply, but they keep coming. I don't see the Strand. Where is it? Pardon me? I am on the precipice of uncovering a pattern of crime across London spanning many months and involving many men. The missing paper cannot be a coincidence. That's preposterous. My dear fellow, life is infinitely stranger than anything which the mind of man can invent. Well, life used your newspaper to wipe its posterior, so after that unpleasant discovery this morning, I disposed of it. But in lieu of the Strand, perhaps I can deliver you something equally tantalizing. I have just returned from a patient of mine, Captain Stemwick, who... No, no, that will not do. Grab your coat, Dr. Watson. Let us hope nobody has collected the dustbin. The dustbin is yours for the digging, Mr. Holmes. Don't look at me. If you want the newspaper, you'll have to get your hands dirty. You were mistaken, Dr. Watson. The paper was indeed dirtied, but not how you implied. It's potting soil. A cactus spine. If it gets in your skin, it's awfully tricky to remove, and when laced with poison, the perfect assassination tool. See, Watson? The conspiracy is real. Someone tried to poison me. Poison? You? That's madness. Get the strand. Get your copy of the strand here. Sorry, Mr. Holmes. I just sold my last paper. Glassed. Then why are you still here? Boss pays by the hour. No sense in returning early. You're a bright child. I presume you see everything that goes on around here? Nothing gets past me, mister. Then tell me, did you notice anyone suspicious at my door this morning? Hmm. Like the man with your newspaper? Precisely. What do you know? I know the value of a shilling. Dr. Watson. Cool! Now I can take the day off. Did you see what he was up to? Nah, not really. I saw him approaching your house, but I had a customer. Then there's a loud bang. I ducked down. Not because I was scared, because I wasn't. I had to protect the merchandise. And all I could see was him kneeling at your door. Which way did he go? Not sure. I was distracted by customers. Sorry. Can you describe the man you saw? He was carrying a lot of books. Up to his chin, they were. Never heard of a well-read assassin. Looks can deceive. 
Hence the... All right. Thanks, Mr. Holmes. Maybe... Come now, Mr. Holmes. Murder? Yes, Barnes has his quirks, but he also Get has his copy of the strand here. Not every pawn knows it's part of a game. Help me, please. No, sir. I've never heard of it. Do you even have enemies that would want to kill you? Okay, perhaps from Cordona. Impressive stature, strong gaze. I think this man deserves a knighthood. Really, Holmes? May I, I ask you, you something? Social? On rare occasions, Watson, it can suffice to trust one's gut. How about that Vogel fellow? He seems rather obsessed with you. Would he do something like this? Mr. Barnes, a word. <gasps> oh, for goodness sake. Who, uh, who goes there? Sherlock Holmes. Now will you please... Mr. Holmes. Golly, I did not see you coming. Would you care to answer... Come now, Mr... No, 
really did. Well, help yourself to any book. Just take it a pay later. Barnes doesn't seem like himself. Why is he acting this way? You're asking the right questions, Doctor. Let's find a way. The ladder is broken recently, judging by the freshness of the wood. I could hardly imagine anything more macabre. Basics of cryptoanalysis, cryptography in Egypt. It appears Barnes has an interesting hobby. <laughs> the finest view London has to offer. language of Mycroft's secret agents, it's a sign. Dried flowers are replaced when the job is done. I wonder who the recipient is. An improvised stand, but it does make the flowers more visible. has always been a little odd, but this is uncharacteristic even for him. Uh, apologies, but I can't hear you. Please come back later. So, Barnes has a dog now. Who's a good boy?
weather is dreary, isn't it? To be fair, my flowers could use the rainfall. You're looking for a cactus needle in a haystack. Hmm. A spine in a book stack? No, come on, Watson, think. 